All day, every day, Randy Jenkins does this. Picking up trash that didn't quite make it into the landfill. He sees just about anything. From medical gloves to boxing gloves, from cardboard to candy. But what he sees the most of... Plastic bags. For, for sure, plastic bags. The plastic bags have always been an issue. They, ease, they catch in the wind real easy and blow a long way. A real long way. You know, it's not uncommon for them to go up two, three, four hundred feet, probably even further. So far that the city has to pay Randy and another person to chase them down. Once you get picked up, you know, we clean this area all up, any area, clean it all up and then the wind picks up and it just covers it up with plastic bags again. But while chasing down plastic bags takes up most of his day. That's what I call his job security. Picking up a few less wouldn't hurt. The World Economic Forum predicts that by 2050, our oceans will contain more plastic than fish. I know they're convenient, but it sure would be nice if folks would use canvas bags or paper bags and recycle them and not put the plastic bags in the trash. So that instead of picking up plastic bags, spend the rest of the day picking up trash. Dane Hawkins, KQ2 News. Randy says every day he picks up enough plastic shopping bags to fill 10 to 12 50-gallon trash bags each.